Hello, my name is Ashton Humphrey, and I am the Director of Choral Activities at Croatan High School. It is with great pleasure that we proudly present our 2020 videoed holiday concert, Speak of the Light. In this concert, you will hear selections from our mixed choir and vocal ensemble that live up to our concert's title by speaking of the goodness that endures throughout dark times, much like the times we face today. Back on March 12, 2020, the day before one of our biggest events of the year music performance adjudication, choirs across the state were notified that there would be no MPA the following day due to this new thing called coronavirus. Little did we know at that time that our spring musical The Sound of Music and our competition trip to Orlando would also have to be canceled because of this new virus. Since then, we have chosen to remain resilient and lean on each other like the family that we are. Even a pandemic could not silence our song. We were determined to create our art again and make life a little bit more beautiful. With the help of our county and school leaders, we've been able to continue singing using air scrubbers and other PPE materials for our classroom and our auditorium. I'm honestly amazed that we've been able to pull this off. Students have been working so hard in person at school and virtually to make this concert a success. Students, I am so proud of your commitment and dedication. I hope you will take the time to read the program notes written by our students that are linked in the video's description. They are truly wonderful. And now, may our voices remind you of the light, even in the darkest of days, as the Croatan choirs present Speak of the Light. So the title Speak of the Light to me means finding the good in the darkness. For me, vocal has really been that light in the darkness because it's given me something to look forward to. And it's really given me a chance to hang out with my friends who are really like my family. Um, it's also given me something to work towards with the concert coming up. And I feel like this concert will be the light in the darkness for a lot of people because it's spreading the Christmas cheer and it'll just be a great time. And it'll also be a fun thing to watch too. So I always feel better when I'm giving to others, especially because I love seeing how it makes them feel and how happy it makes them. When I'm able to help others and like spread that Christmas cheer and spread that light, it makes me feel really good because it helps um, them feel the same way that vocal makes me feel. I'm part of a, like a lot of different groups, but a lot of those when COVID hit were completely canceled. And so my schedule went from being a hundred things a day to nothing. And so being part of Vocal and having that group chat and those people that I can still talk to. And then even Vocal is one of the first things that we were really able to do again. Like if we had to find ways around it, but we were still able to do it. It really felt really good just being part of that group still. And knowing that you have those people that are here if you need to talk. And especially Mr. Humphrey, he always has been reaching out to us and talking to us and it's felt really good to know that you're not alone in this time which a lot of people do feel because you have to be so isolated from everyone.
Uh, so vocal has been a light to me during quarantine because it's the class that most people look forward to every day. And even though we're not able to see each other, um, that hasn't changed. And it's given us a chance to see everyone that we missed, um, even though we're not able to see each other much more often. Uh, but the family dynamic is definitely still there and brings a lot of normality to our crazy lives. Choir has been really positive for me during COVID because it's given me a chance to feel like I'm, like my schedule hasn't changed. Like I'm still going to vocal every day. I'm still looking at my music. I'm still interacting with my peers. And it's just been something great like to ground me during this time. Um, I hope that people will see the concert and like realize that while things may be crazy, we can still come together and be together while being safe. And um, like we don't have to feel so crazy in a time where things can be so peaceful and relaxing. Um, I feel proud of us because we've accomplished so much for like such a like monumental thing. This hasn't ever happened to pretty much anyone in this generation. And being able to show other schools and choirs like you can still accomplish greatness and you can like perform and do a concert and it's very proud of us.
Croatan High School Choral Department is dedicated to providing meaningful opportunities for our students. Our program relies on financial support from live performances. This year, in lieu of a concert admission, we humbly ask for your donation for our virtual holiday performance. Your donation will help provide for further opportunities like this one for our students. If you would like to make a donation using Venmo, use the username at Croatan Choir. We thank you for your continued support and happy holidays. I would say the most challenging part of preparing a concert during COVID-19 was having three groups working at totally different paces and all coming together for our joined rehearsals. However, we were able to set goals in place and accomplish those goals while overcoming any obstacles that got in our way. We faced many obstacles such as, as we would in the past stand closer together, um, now we're forced to stand six feet apart and that's a lot harder when you're in choir. Um, having to sing when you can only hear yourself, the point of choir is balancing with voices around you and it's really hard to do that when all you can hear is yourself. Um, it's been really something to look forward to um, when you constantly have something you're working towards. Say for instance, if you're learning a new song or preparing for a concert, you want it to be the very best that it can be and you're working hard, especially knowing that there's gonna be others listening to it. Focusing on goals throughout COVID and choir has helped to distract from things going on in the world and just allow you to focus on um, what you want to accomplish. Oh, you're born in 
So my favorite thing about being all together is we can be with each other and lift each other up. It's very hard times we are in now. And when we're together, we can take on problems together. And this concert is really nice to have us all working together towards a common goal and us to really just support each other and be there for each other. Some of my favorite things that choir has given to us is just a mental break from everything because choir is the one thing that's remained constant throughout this entire thing because you can stand six feet apart and sing. It's just really helped us all as people, ourselves, and just offered us just a little bit of normal in this time. So through our virtual concert, we want to try and communicate a sense of hope and joy for the people watching. We know that in COVID, it's hard and you might find yourself in the darkness, but we want to be a light for these people and give them a sense of happiness. So we want to be that light and happiness through our emotions while we sing, through our words as we sing, and our movements. It makes me feel awesome having that opportunity to be a light for someone, and it's really cool how just music and singing can really change a person's attitude. <laughs> 